Welcome to the Nav Viking tutorials. I'm Johannes Gudmundsson, founder of Anecta, a Microsoft Dynamics NAV Gold certified partner. Anecta University, which is uh, a portion of Anecta, it's a, it's a part of what we do, uh, is going to have a bootcamp. Uh, it's a Dynamics NAV bootcamp. So in the video's description, this video, uh, there is going to be a link. So go ahead and click on that link if you're interested in this uh, and you can sign up. Hello everyone, welcome to the Coffee Mac tutorials. Uh, we keep going on bank stuff. Uh, this is sort of in the sequence of bank reconciliations, but I am going to widen the scope a little bit. Uh, what I want to talk about is positive pay. I'm not sure if everyone knows what that is, but uh, it's supported in NAV. So I'm going to tell you what it is and tell you how it works. All right. So um, if we go here into uh, start with finance here, I'm just going to go into a payment journal, right? And into bank payments here, edit the journal. I'm going to write one manual check. So if I go in here, I'm going to send it out. Let's say the check number is one, two, three, four, six. Uh, account number is London Postmaster, right here. Uh, payment method is check. It's for $1,200. And bank payment type is a manual check right here. Okay, so when we write checks out of the bank, uh, we mail them out. This is... Uh, it's more popular in the US than probably anywhere else in the world. Um, <laughs> but anyways, so you mail out the check. The check is somewhere out there. Somebody can pick it up uh, and try to cash it, uh, you know, by, you know, trying to steal the money, etc. So how can you make sure that the proper person is cashing the check? Uh, and there really is no good method uh, except positive pay. Positive pay, what that allows you to do is notify the bank that you cut this check and the bank should be on the lookout for that check to be cast by that person. So first of all, uh, obviously it knows which person is supposed to be uh, casting the check. It also knows which checks you wrote so that people don't take empty check stock. I guess it's more for that if uh, people take an empty check stock write their own checks or falsify the checks and try to cash them. If if the amounts don't match, the dates don't match or something like that, the bank will reject it if it's on positive pay. So it's a security measure um, and it's supported by NAV. So we get, get this check, we're gonna post it. So that means I wrote that check, it's manual, it's posted in the system. Uh, and now I can actually go into the bank uh, account this is the operating and I could go here into positive pay export. So I've written two checks, one for 800 and one for 1200. Uh, and I can basically just give it the upload date, last upload date. So uh, it filters everything that I wrote and then I can export it out and it exports into a file and that file you just upload into the bank. Now I wish Yodly or some other service could automate this. So they just send it all over without a problem, but it doesn't look like it's doing that. Uh, that could probably be modified in the system for you, but this is file upload. Now, on top of it being a file upload, what you need to do in to order to set this up, you actually have to specify the positive pay export format here on the bank account. So if I go in here and try to set one up out of the test system or Corona system, there is none. None to be found. Um, so if I actually look up here uh, and it's filtering by positive pay and the bank export import setup, it doesn't find anything. If I actually release the filter just to show you what things are being uh, set up here, this is all of the SEPA stuff. Um, and you can see here investment Yodli is set up, etc. But positive pay for some reason 
is not in the basic uh, test database. So you'd have to find that uh, maybe your partner can help you with that, setting up deposit or pay with the bank. But the structure is there um, to actually get it out of the system. So um, again, Microsoft would be great if we just connected it to a service like Yodli. Maybe they don't do it. I don't know. Uh, but Yodli seems to be better at getting the transactions from the bank and being reconciled rather than actually pushing it out. So I hope you got something out of this. It clarified a little bit how things are set up in NAV. Positive pay is very important. If you guys are not using that today, I would definitely move forward and using that for uh, security sake. So until next time, thank you. Bye-bye.